a new chaining method has been introduced for FeatureCam 2013 R3. This works on large geometry datasets automatically without the need for lots of clicking. The process involves taking a number of connecting geometry pieces and then using the new Merge Curves option joins those segments together. This makes feature curve creation much faster and easier to use. In this particular example, if I zoom into any of these regions, you'll notice that we have a lot of geometry and each of these pieces geometry is separate lines and circles. In fact, if I go ahead and just turn on my snap mode and turn on my circle centers, we can see the number of center points that appear indicating there are a large number of circles in this part. So what we want to do is we want to connect these geometry pieces up together. Now in this case at the moment you can see I've got no curves created in my part view. I'm going to hide the stock for the time being just so I'm dealing with the geometry. Now in the past I would have had to go and use the close curve option and join the segments together manually but this would have taken a lot of clicking. We now have a new option that allows me to merge these items together. I can access this either via this construct menu curve from curve merge or I can do it via the curve wizard. In this case I'm going to do control A and select everything and use the wizard. In this case we choose curve from curve merge curves choose next you get a tolerance as to how close we match these curves and then we give it a curve name which is the starting curve name preview I get a preview like so I can then say finish and that's now generated all of these separate curves I can hide the geometry I'm going to select all the curves except for the outside one and then create my engraving in this case I'm going to create a groove with all my curves in this case I'm just going to change the depth and the width to be one millimeter once I'm happy with the default tool selection I can say finish say OK to that feature the final one I want to do is a chamfer around the outside edge so I'm going to choose chamfer just check the direction and then into my size which in this case I'll make it 5 millimeters. I can now play my 3D simulation and I get my engraved sign like so.